Good day, Dino friends. Today, I was not supposed to make a video, but apparently all of the egg hunts, eggs, all the eggs of the Roblox Egg Hunt 2020 are now officially leaked. You can find out what they look like exactly and wh what game you can find them in. And I was very surprised because some of my favorite games in Roblox finally have eggs. Build a Boat for Treasure, as you could see in the picture at the title, and Dragon Adventures have an egg. If these leaks are real, and I'm pretty sure they are real they look very real they might be there's like a small like one percent chance they're fake but like all of these eggs i've seen them on multiple leak sites and twitter and on multiple places and videos so i'm pretty sure these are real so i'm very excited so i thought i will very quickly even though i'm not supposed to make a video today even though i'm not supposed to record a video today i'm very quickly going to record my reaction to the eggs a quick um egg review let's just do an egg review so i was just on twitter when i saw a tweet by someone called dido roblox so shout out to dido roblox go follow them on twitter they said i have all the new eggs in my inventory so what they did is they didn't get the real eggs like cheetah to get the real eggs they just took all the models from roblox all the eggs and they made them into models that you can put in your game so if you want to put the new eggs in your game already you can you have to click the link that he put and it's his inventory in roblox and as you can see seriously look at all of these beautiful eggs i actually love them i saw some people saying they don't like them i really love them i really think a lot of them look really good so let's just go buy them one by one and see what they look like and see uh what game you get them from one by one we're going to review all of the eggs so this is the first one that they have and as i already said these aren't the eggs they actually took the eggs from roblox and make them into a model so if you click the get button then you get them as a model that you can put in your roblox game so that's pretty cool maybe we should make a game where we put all the eggs or make our own little egg hunt that would be a lot of fun Anyway, let's just get started with the egg review 2020. The first one is called the egg Therian. I don't know what that is supposed to mean. This egg, oh, from a Monsters of Etheria. I don't actually remember that game. Is that a fun game? I don't actually remember which game that is. It looks pretty funny if you would get like a purple clothes and then wear this as your head. That would look pretty cool. Very basic. Uh, I don't think this is going to be one of my favorites, but it's a pretty funny egg. Just basic Easter bunny ear. It's an egg. There's bunny ears and it has a kind of like a baby chicken face. Like with baby chickens are also usually like a symbol of easter so you know what pretty cool i think monsters of etheria is a good game i don't just remember it exactly which one it was treasure quest egg okay so this one doesn't have a name yet it just so, some of them they don't have the official name yet it just says the game so treasure quest is a fun i know a lot of people watching this like treasure quest so i think it'll be a fun uh time getting this by the way tomorrow i'll be streaming we'll probably be looking at all of these eggs and maybe we We'll just play a lot of the games where the eggs is going to be are going to be to try to be prepared because in a lot of these games i'm a really big noob i don't know about you guys i think there are very few people who are really good at all of these games at the same time everyone is good at some games but bad at some others you know okay so this one just uh sadly you cannot rotate these but yeah you can see what they look like this one's just a potion i actually really like the colors uh, but it doesn't really look... It's like slightly egg-shaped, but it, if you would just pretend it's just a potion and not an egg, it's just a potion. It's just a potion with a really bad shape, because if it has a round bottom, it's just going to fall over. <laughs> okay, um... Next egg, Tower Defense Simulator. Now, I know a lot of you guys love Tower Defense Simulator because when we go live, a lot of you guys ask, let's play Tower Defense Simulator. So a lot of you guys will be pros and be getting this egg. That's what I think. The egg looks like kind of like a smiling face with uh, above it, a, well, different smiling face. One with the eyes closed and mouth open. One with the mouth closed and eyes open. Uh, I think it's pretty funny. Uh, kind of like the Tower of Eggs or Tower of noob heads that some of some people wear it would this would actually look good if you just have the basic noob outfit the square body with the blue shirt and the green pants and then if you wear this it looks kind of like as if you would be a happy noob with two heads 
Uh, Tower Defense Simulator isn't really my favorite game, but I know a lot of you are pro. So once again, I'm asking for your financial support. I mean, I'm asking for your gaming support. Uh, when we're going to live stream and next week we're going to live stream a lot of uh, egg hunt uh, I hope you guys will join me if you're a pro at the game join me and help me find this egg And I will try to help you guys in the games where I'm good at it Okay, so let's just check out the next one Tiny tanks. Yes, tiny tanks is one of those games where I really not play it a lot But it is a super fun game if you don't know what tiny tanks is is um, a tank game where you play as a toy tank And you look from the top and you can choose which direction you shoot It's a super fun game and it's not like super Violent like real tanks because it's toy tanks. So you shoot with like toy bullets and stuff So it's very kid-friendly and it's a super fun game and it's inspired. I'm pretty sure it's inspired by that Wii game where you can play as a tank. I don't know if you guys know that game, but it's super fun. So of course the egg looks like pretty much it's just a tank in the shape of an egg a little bit. Uh, I think they could have made it more detailed. Uh, it's not my favorite, but my in game this is definitely one of my favorite games. Or well, not not top ten, but definitely top hundred. I think I really like Tiny Tanks. It's a super fun game. Uh, let's see, time travel adventures. Yes. I know that time travel adventures, if it's the game that I'm thinking of, time travel adventures has a dinosaur level. So I'm kind of hoping it will be in the dinosaur level, but maybe it won't be. Uh, we cannot know. Uh, I think we cannot know. Maybe there are spoilers already, but yeah, I hope it will be in a dinosaur level. Um, so the egg looks like it has like a timer on it or some kind of maybe a bomb. There's like a portal that, of course, a time travel portal. Uh, then a lot of wires and like some kind of energy beam thing, whatever you want to call it. Like a radio radio signal transmitter or something. I don't know. I don't know. It looks like it could explode or something. I don't know. This one's kind of scary. Please don't explode. Time travel egg. So texting simulator egg. Uh, I'm going to be honest. I have never played texting simulator in my entire life. I'm sorry. It just, I don't know. I guess we'll have to play it. We want this egg. It looks, I think the egg looks really fun. It looks a little bit like a Tamagotchi, except it's of course supposed to be a phone in the shape of an egg, which is a pretty fun idea. Imagine if that existed, a phone in the shape of an egg. I cannot really say anything about this game as I've never played it, but the egg, I think it looks a lot of fun. Um, I'm just afraid because it's so flat. If you wear it on your head around your head because it's so flat, as if your face is just going to stick out out of it because it's so flat actually maybe we can find out if that's true give me one second so the person on twitter that i was talking about dido actually also posted pictures of what they look like when you're wearing them so once again shout out go follow them on twitter or youtube if they have that i don't know let's see texting simulator egg you can actually see what the eggs look like when you wear them they all look the same as in last years where you just wear them around your head that's just always the same um, okay, is the te one is just a boat, by the way. I don't- that's- how is this an egg? This is not a- it's literally a boat. <laughs> and by the way, that's not the build boat for Treasure 1. This is, I think, the build boat for Treasure 1. Okay, it's very small in this picture, but it looks like the head is not sticking out of it. But if you have a very forward face, like one with a big nose or whatever, or maybe like a dinosaur, like myself, then it will stick out, I think. Okay, so that's enough about this egg. I'm actually not supposed to make a video today, so let's just quickly move on to the next egg, okay? Shh, don't tell my boss, even though I'm a boss. Even though YouTube is my boss, I guess, I don't know. Uh, the Wild West Egg. Is that... I keep thinking of Wild Revolvers, but I think this is a different game. Uh, you guys have asked me to play it, but I've actually never played it so far. Uh, so the Wild West, I'm guessing it's a cowboy game. Maybe shooting. I'm not very good at shooting games, so I hope not. Um, this is a not the greatest angle for this picture of this egg. But it seems to be wearing a cowboy hat with... I don't know what the zebra colored thing is coming out. It has a mustache and a beard. And some rope and a little bandana around its neck. Dido, show us again where, what it looks like when you wear it. Okay, there it is. That's what it looks... Once again, it's so small. But when you wear it, if you put like a very nice bandit outfit on. Or cowboy outfit, I think it would look nice. It reminds me of Inigo Montoya. Because he has the same mustache. You have killed my father. Prepare to die. I don't even know how he says it. I've not watched that movie in too long. Next egg, please. 
The Supercharged Striker Egg. I don't know what that means. It can be obtained in Super Striker League. First off, I've never played that game. Second off, I've never heard of it. And third off, the name doesn't give me any idea what kind of game it is. Super Striker League. Could be any game. It could be a, a, a board game. It could be like a fighting game. It could be a puzzle. I have no idea. But the egg, honestly, it looks super cool. I think this egg looks really cool with the shapes and the colors. I actually really like this egg. Very cool. Um... If you know what this game is, please explain it in the comments or come to one of my live streams. Starting this weekend, we're probably going to stream almost every day. Just try until we get all the eggs and maybe then we'll keep streaming. Because if you look at this, if I do get a launcher, probably not. I probably won't get a launcher. But if Roblox is nice to me and they give me egg launchers just like the other years. Wait, does it still work? Click. Oh, it doesn't work anymore. Ah. Oh. Of course it doesn't work. I don't know why I expected it to work. But yeah, if they give me egg launchers, then I will of course keep streaming. Just like 10 hours a day. Just keep streaming. Keep giving everyone as many eggs as possible. But yeah, as you guys know, Roblox doesn't really like me. They don't consider me a YouTuber or a video star. So I cannot have it. Yes, I'm salty. Stop. Stop. I know I'm salty. I know I'm salty. Stop it. I'm not really YouTuber, okay? Okay, next egg. <gasps> Speed race egg. Yes. I'm actually... I don't know. Have I told... I think I've told you guys this a few times. But just in case you don't know, I'm a super addict of speed race. I used to play this game so much. I used to... Every time I play nowadays, except for the new maps, I pretty much get first place every time I play. Because I'm, I just know the races and the tracks so well. So this one is hopefully going to be pretty easy for me to get. Um, except if they make a new racetrack, which is... There's actually a fair chance that they made a new racetrack for it. So... I might not be that good at the race, but it's definitely going to be a lot of fun to get it because this is one of my favorite games, except for one glitch that happens a lot in this game. But I won't tell you about that today because when we're live streaming it, I'll probably get salty and complain about the glitch a lot. So we'll save that for another day. Anyway, the egg looks pretty cool. So it's made out of gold with chains around it. And then there's like a time... Um, Time sand. What, what do you call this in English? I don't actually know what the English word is. Time sand or something. And there's a little noob in it. In it and just like in the Al uh, Aladdin movie, he's like, Help me! Help me! It's just like the Aladdin movie. But that's of course a symbol for time because you have to be fast to win the race. That's also why there seems to be like an image of a clock on the egg. Maybe I'm seeing something that looks like the image of a clock. I don't know. Anyway, pretty cool egg. I like it. Um, let's move on to the next one. Super Doomspire Egg. Okay, Super Doomspire Brick Battle is a game that you guys very often ask me to play. But I almost never play it. I think it's the one where you use, like, rocket launcher to shoot down the towers? Is that the one? I don't know. I think I know a lot of you guys are pro at it. So you guys are just going to have to help me, okay? The egg looks really cool. So it's a black cat with a little crown in four... I, can, I think I'm seeing four colors. So yellow and red. And then in the back, I'm seeing green and blue. So it just has the four colors. I don't know what the, why it looks like that. I don't know. Maybe I'm thinking of the wrong game. Maybe Super Doomspire Brick Battle is a game about a cat. I don't actually know. I don't actually know. Maybe I'm mistaking. Uh... Let's just go to the next egg, because I don't know what I'm talking about. You guys will correct me in the comments, probably. Ski Resort Egg. Oh, have I played this? I don't think I have played this. Ski Resort. Okay, but it sounds simple. You just go to a ski resort. You probably have to do, like, skiing or snowboarding to get the egg, probably? Is my guess? I don't know. So it's an icy colored egg with ice crystals around it, with more snowflakes around it, with wearing a hat in the same colors. Literally the entire egg has so many different blues and whites in it. And there's even snow on it. And I don't know why there's a hole in it. I guess that's where your face is. Wait, wait, hang on. Let's check out the image, what it looks like on your face. There it is. Okay, you can almost not see it. This image is so small. Very small image. Okay, anyway, I think I'm seeing like the face sticking out. So that is what that is. So there's a hole here and your face will be sticking out like... 
I'm stuck in the ice. Britannic Egg. Okay, so the makers of the uh, Roblox Titanic game, the game where you go on the Titanic and then it sinks. They, I think they only recently, unless if I'm mistaken, but they also have a game about the Britannic. And if you don't know the Britannic, it is the other ship, the sis one of the sister ships of the Titanic. And the Britannic also sank, but a lot less people died. Also over like a hundred years ago, I think not that long. After I think it was after the Titanic. I don't know that much about the Britannic, um, but uh, but when the Britannic sank, a lot less people died. Only a few people died because it was very close to the beach, I think. But I don't remember exactly, so I'll just stop talking. Um, yeah, that will be a lot of fun to learn about it because it's a game where you can play, but you also kind of learn about the ship. So it shows the Britannic sinking uh, in an egg that just in an egg <laughs> it's instead of sinking in the water it's sinking in an egg that is cool because from another year i don't know if it was last year or the year before that we also had an egg tannic which is the egg that looks like the titanic okay shard seekers egg shard seekers i think i've have I played Shard Secret? Wait, hang on. I don't know if I've ever played this game. Oh, I like that I'm seeing a dinosaur. Wait, this game has dinosaurs? Yeah, no, I don't. I'm, I I think it's one of those RPG games just based on popular uh, uh, MMORPGs. You can just ha uh, fight the monsters like a fantasy game, I think. I don't think I've played it or maybe once or twice. Uh, let's see. So it's just an egg. Honestly, it looks kind of weird. It reminds me, uh, if you don't count the two crystals, which are pretty cool, or multiple crystals coming out, um, the egg kind of looks like a geological formation with all the layers of the different times in the past. So for as someone who kind of likes geology, was kind of interested in it, it's kind of an interesting egg, actually. Maybe geology is an Im important part of the uh, this game. I don't actually know. Um, anyway, we still have a lot of eggs to go, so let's just move on to the next one. Egg of Cthulhu. That is cool. Can be obtained in scuba diving at Quill Lake. Okay, we have played that before for an event one time, I think, or twice. So that's the one where you just go diving. I think we can do it. I think that's a fun game. You can go diving and stuff. Uh, the egg just looks like Cthulhu. There's nothing more to it. It has the uh, wings behind it. This is actually a pretty cool egg that would suit my outfit because I'm a green dino. So if I wear this egg, I think it would look pretty cool on me. Yeah, definitely a very cool egg that's going to look cool with a lot of uh, outfits. Okay, Saber Boss Egg. This egg can be found in Saber Simulator. I don't actually know this game. But sabers are swords, so I guess it's about sword fighting. And since it's called Saber Boss Egg, I guess you have to defeat a boss for it. I don't actually know. Let me know if you play this game. The egg looks pretty cool, though. It's like a head, a very cool, like, head with a mask and wearing a hood. Uh, except it has two swords through the head. So you're dead. You're, you're definitely oofed if you have two swords in your head. So I don't know how that's possible. But yeah, it looks pretty cool. Once again, if you wear the right clothes, like blue and... Uh, blue and black clothes with it is going to look really cool. You're going to make a cool outfit with this. Okay, then we've got the real meme egg, the Despacito egg, or the Despacit egg, which can be obtained in Robloxian High School. I think this egg is like a joke, because in Robloxian High Schools, you can make crazy outfits if you use that outfit maker, where you can put combine all the different items. People, I think maybe that's where the Despacito uh, noob thing came from. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah. Uh, the problem is that it has six legs. Spiders have eight legs. Come on, get it right. <laughs> it kind of bugs me, no pun intended, that it has six legs and not eight. But other than that, it's a pretty funny, kind of just a meme egg. I bet a lot of people will be wearing this just for the meme. Let's see, the gourmet egg. If that's how, Is that how you pronounce it? Gour, 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 gourmet. Gourmet. I don't know how to pronounce I think you pronounce it gourmet. Uh, this egg can be obtained in Restaurant Tycoon 2. Wait, is that the one? Okay, there's one of them where I'm a pro. I think actually in Restaurant Tycoon 1... I have, I'm like super rich and I have a really good restaurant. And in number two, I've never played it. Dang it. Dang it. I, <laughs> I think this is the one where I don't have a good restaurant. Okay. Anyway, it, it looks actually kind of similar to another egg. Uh, two years ago, I'm pretty sure in 2018, we had an egg that looks like a chef. 
Give me a second. Let's see. Yep. Okay, so this is one egg that we had two years ago. So it has a chef's hat and the mustache. This egg right here. So that one is from two years ago. And this one looks like this. I think it's kind of similar. It has, to, it has a spatula and glasses, which is different. But other than that... Come on, give us some new eggs, Roblox. Come on. I don't know. I guess I guess every egg is nice, but this one is really a little bit too similar, I think, to that one from two years ago. Uh, let's see. My Droplet Egg. Oh, I like that game. I once almost made a video about it. So if you don't know, My Droplets is a game where you get a little pet. It looks a little bit like this thing with the ears. Um, it's kind of like Meep City where you have a Meep, where, which is a ball with a face. And in My Droplet, they look a little bit cuter. So you get them. Uh, it's a little bit like Meep City, I guess, because you get these pets right from the start. And then you have to take care of your pets while you're kind of like rope playing it's kind of a game that's nice for people who also like meep city or adopt me and games like that uh, but it's definitely fun to play it just to get the egg and the egg looks really nice i like that it has flowers and stuff then we have the heroic egg of owl owlsomeness okay what does that mean it can be obtained in hero havoc i don't actually know this game what is hero havoc havoc, havoc. i don't know what that means uh, I guess maybe an RPG kind of game. So it's an owl with a horn coming out of its head. That is intense. That is intense. Uh, I kind of actually like it. I like it. Not even just as an egg, but just like you could just use it, this and put it in your game and pretend that it's just a bird with a horn for some reason. <laughs> then we have the Egg of Calamity 2020. This is a cool looking egg. It can be obtained in hotel stories. Is that a story game? Is that like... Um, is that like camping? One of those story games? I don't actually know hotel stories. But that is a cool looking egg. It's just... It's an actual egg with snakes coming out of it. So it's one of the only eggs in the egg hunt that is an actual egg. Because it's a snake egg. Uh, except only one snake comes out of a snake egg, of course. And I think snake eggs look very different. But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Stop being so serious, Tommy. Does stop being so serious. I think this looks very cool. It looks a little bit similar once again to an egg from before. There we go. So here is the egg called the dragon. Here we go. So it's like a red egg with a dragon going around it. So if you look at this one, it's also a red egg or well, pinkish red with the snake going around it. So it's kind of similar, but it's not the same. Okay, what is this? Tentacle alien. Tent egg call. Sorry. Uh, and you can get it from Theme Park Gravity Oasis. Yes. Yes, I don't actually know this game, but I love playing theme park games just because they give me ideas for what I can put in my own dino park game. So I'm looking forward to trying out this game. Uh, so apparently the egg is an alien. It's holding a noob and a, I think that's a plane or a UFO. I think a plane in its other hand. I love how it's a nose. I have not seen a lot of aliens ever in any movie or game that had like just literally just a nose <laughs> straight up. Anyway, I think it's really cool, especially if you uh, wear a nice outfit of the right colors under it. It's going to look really cool. Then we have the ghastly egg. Is that how you pronounce it? Ga ghast ga ghastly. Ghastly egg. Uh, it can be obtained in Ghost Simulator. Oh, when that first came out, I loved that game. I was addicted to it for like a few days. Like when it literally just came out, I played it for like three hours straight. Uh, I haven't really played it since. I'm sorry to Ghost Simulator, but I know that I'm going to love getting this egg because that game is a lot of fun to play. So the egg looks like just like a green slimy ghost coming out of something purple which could be a UFO or a hole in the ground. I don't actually know what that purple is supposed to be. But yeah, it's kind of the it's kind of blurry. The face is kind of weird, but if you wear the right outfit, I think it will look kind of cool. Yeah, I don't know if I'll be wearing this one a lot. Okay, we have the Royal Egg of the Bearers. This egg can be obtained in Bear. Is that a game? Is there a game called literally just bear and nothing else i've never heard of that game before bear i don't know that game <laughs> i don't know i've never heard of a game called just bear uh, even the egg doesn't look like a bear so it's a purple egg with a round nose a mouth made out of blobs or something 3d glasses horns and it's on a pillow 
I don't know what to say about that. That confuses me. That confuses me. Also, it's going to be weird when you wear it because then the pillow will be like around your neck. I don't know. I don't know. I think it's a pretty cool egg, I guess. The last egg of the minery. This egg can be obtained in minery. I don't actually know that game. I'm guessing it's a mining game. You have to mine. The egg actually looks like uh, when you find crystals, when you break a rock in half and there's crystals inside. That's kind of what it looks like. Very cool. Um, except when you wear it, your face is going to stick out half of it. So that's not as cool. I don't really like eggs that don't cover your head. So your head is just sticking out. But I don't know. I think it's... I, I, let, let's check for a second what this one looks like. Oh, there it is. Yeah, okay. So your head is definitely just kind of sticking out of it. I don't like when that happens. I don't I don't know. I, I wish they made your head invisible, but of course that's not possible. Okay, the next egg is called Shady Subject. Shady Subject. It can be found in Murder. I don't know that game. Mur just Murder, not Murder Mystery or... Okay, I don't, I'm not sure if I know that game, but you guys, maybe some of you guys. I can't really see what it is. I'm sorry, it's like an egg. I can see something sticking out of here, and then there's something black and red sticking out. But honestly, I don't know what it is. Like part of a mask or something, or a head. I'm sorry, this is one where I'm going to say I have no idea what it really is. I'm sorry. <laughs> maybe we will fi find out what it is. It's probably something from the game that I don't know. <gasps> There it is, you guys. The Dragon Adventure Egg or the Dragon Egg Venture. This egg can be obtained in Dragon Adventures. I don't have to tell you guys that we play that game a lot on this channel, unless if you're new. We play this game all the time. I actually just recorded another episode with Fluffy and I was planning to make more episode next week. So yeah, this egg, I'm definitely going to get this egg. It looks so beautiful. Uh, just half of an egg with like water in it. And there's just, it's like a little bath for the dragon and the dragon looks so adorable it has adorable eyes the dragon really fits the style of the game with the way that it has the beautiful eyes and colors and shading and the shape of the ears and the shape of the snout and just that it's so happy i really think it fits the game so yeah i'm very looking forward to getting this egg very cool love it thank you roblox for putting dragon adventures in okay samurai egg this egg can be obtained in dungeon quest Oh wait, the other game was called Adventure Quest. This one is Dungeon Quest. I'm sorry, I don't know the difference which one is which. I think Dungeon Quest is the one that we've done a bunch of times. Where you guys keep trying to give me weapons and stuff. I think I know that game. I think I know the game. I hope you don't have to be like super high level to uh, get this egg. It's pretty cool though. It's just literally just a red egg with a samurai helmet on it. Uh, I think some of the very good shirt makers in Roblox can make a really good shirt. Or if you guys are watching this and you know how to make shirts... This is the time, if you want to get some real Robux, this is the time to start making shirts for all of these eggs and people will buy them. I will buy them. If you make some, like, if you make, like, a really good shirt and pants that looks like samurai armor to fit this egg, then you can make a really cool outfit with it. Marine exhibit. Egg, egg hibbit. Okay, so it's supposed to be a fishbowl uh, as an egg. I don't know if it's actually entirely transparent or, like, open. I can't see from this 2D picture. Um, it can be obtained from Flop. I don't actually know that game, but that sounds like a really funny game. Are you just a fish that flops around? Because if that's true, then that's hilarious. I want to play that right now. Oh, wait, the music keeps playing when you're disconnected. Okay, great. We'll just keep that on just for the music. Here it is. Your head sticks out and the fish kind of comes out of your head. I'm sorry I don't have a bigger picture. Um, so it looks like it's literally just an egg-shaped fishbowl with the with the fish, but your head kind of sticks out. That's kind of sad. That kind of ruins it. A, not, not too much, but a little bit. So your head will be sticking out kind of here. So, hmm... I don't like that that part of it. This one is literally just called egg. This egg can be obtained in egg testing. So maybe this is not a real egg hunt egg. Because if you get it from egg testing, that this might just be an egg that they used as an object to test the egg hunt in an egg testing game. Egg hunt testing game. But maybe it's real. I don't actually know. But it's literally just an egg with a noob face and a cowboy hat. So... 
I guess I, I really, what I like about it is that it looks so old school with the noob face and stuff. It looks really old school. So yeah, I really like that. Oh, am I seeing epic mini games? Epic mini games. Epic egg 2020. This egg can be obtained in epic mini games. I knew it. I saw it right away. I didn't have to read any of the text. I can see, uh, especially down here, you can see the train from the train mini game. You can see the blocks from the blocks mini game. You can see the temple from the temple run mini game. So. If, so my guess is that maybe they're going to add a new mini game, or that you get the egg if you complete the temple run or whatever the name is, the, the one where you have to go into the temple and get to the treasure, that obby mini game, because that's the one that that they are showing right here. So yeah, and I think the egg will actually have more mini games on it, but I cannot uh, rotate it. Then we can maybe check it out from another side. Okay. Let's see if this works. Okay, we have the train, we have the blocks. Ooh, okay. Oh, you see that they have it, it, there's a little jump rope image on the other side. Oh, that is pretty cool. Okay, by the way, if you're wondering, why don't you look at all the eggs here in Roblox Studio? That would take a lot of time. I don't have that much time today. I'm not supposed to make a video today. So yeah, I'm just quickly looking at them right now. At least that was the plan of being recording for 40 minutes. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I love epic minigames, you guys know that. So this is one is going to be a lot of fun to get. I will try to be less salty this year, okay? I will try. <laughs> okay, here we have one of the best eggs. Finally, build a boat for treasure gets an official egg. The build a boat for treasure gets an official egg. Are you serious? Yes, I really want this to be real. I don't think this is fake. As you guys know, we play build a boat for treasure a lot. We haven't played it in a while, so this is a perfect reason to play it again. I'm still ridiculously rich in this game for some reason with my two point something trillion coins that I have. So this game, this egg is perfect to show how rich I am. So <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I just like that it's a treasure egg. It's pretty cool. So it has wings, which I guess is a symbol for for maybe the jetpack, the wing jetpack. Then it's a treasure chest with blue on it. Uh, I guess the red stripes are, they would make an X if it was closed. So it's like X marks the spot. And then you have a lot of coins, gems, gold bars, uh, just really cool. The only sad thing about it, just like I said before, is that your head is going to stick out of it. Here it is. Okay, so your head sticks out of it, but it still looks pretty cool. It still looks pretty cool, even if your head is sticking out. So yeah, I can't wait to get that one. I can't wait. That That's probably going to be one of the first ones we get. Let's just get the most fun ones first or last. Maybe it's best if we save the most fun one for last. Okay, so here we have the Brain Freeze Egg. This one can be found in Icebreaker. The game where you like hit each other and then you turn into ice. Remember that game? We've played that a lot. Um, so it looks like it's literally just ice in the shape of an egg. Is that it? Okay, here it is. Okay, so it's not actually transparent. It's literally just ice in the shape of an egg. <laughs> that is what it is. Anyway, there are... This game is one of those games, it's a lot of fun when you start, but then it gets a little bit laggy, and you get frozen by someone who didn't even hit you and stuff like that, and that's when I start getting salty. So this is one of those games, it can be a lot of fun, or very frustrating, depending on how much lag there is. So I hope it's going to be a lot of fun to get this egg. Let's see, the swarming egg of the hive, I can already guess. This one is from Bee Swarm Simulator. You guys still love this game. I'm actually, I have a lot of respect for this game, for how popular this game still is. After all this time, this game is still so popular. And yeah, I haven't played it in a while, but I'm looking forward to getting this egg. It's not very beautiful. It doesn't even really look that much like an egg. It looks like a honeycomb or however you say it with a star on it for some reason. Uh, I guess this is where your face comes out. That would be pretty funny if your face comes out here. Okay, so they don't have it in the images. Okay, so we don't know. We don't know, but I'm guessing maybe your face comes out here. That would be pretty funny. Then here we have the egg munition or ammunition, which means, you know, bullets and stuff. Uh, it can be found in bad business. I've never played that. I don't know what it is, but since the egg has bullets and stuff, I'm guessing it's a shooting game, fighting game. It's a pretty, I really like the color. It's a very nice color green, very nice shade of green. Um, other than that, uh, I'm not really a big violence person, of course. I like to keep the videos kid-friendly. Uh, 
So I don't know if what kind of game this is. I hope it's not like a serious war game. Just like a just a fun game for, that's also kid friendly, please. Yeah, but the egg, I think the egg looks really cool. Especially the texture is pretty detailed. Like the little rust or whatever it is looks very cool then here we have the egg of hearts which you can get from astral hearts i don't know that game is that is that like a royale high kind of game i don't actually know where you what, what, what game that is but it looks very cool uh so it's a white egg with like ribbons and hearts it shows a little what is that a p like for princess or something I don't actually know. I think this egg is mo mostly for girls, but I'm not really sure. Oh, this one is so funny. This one, I'm looking forward to seeing a lot of people wear this one. You know, this this is one of those eggs that just looks good when you wear it. With the, the, Doesn't matter what outfit you have. You just put it on your head and put like a little suit under it. And now you are a duck in a suit or a chick. You're a chick in a suit. You can get it in Adopt Me. Um, I almost never play that game. But it's still like most, I think it's the most popular Roblox game for like a year now. So yeah, but I'm not really good at role playing games. So I hope it won't be hard to get. Do we have to role play our way to get it? Just pretend you get it and then you get it. I don't actually know, but I really love the way the egg, what the egg looks like. Very beautiful. Uh, whatever floats your boat egg. Okay, so you get this. It, this is the one that I said it's, it's, a, it's literally not an egg. It is a boat. That it, there's no way you can go around this. You could have made it look like it. There's like a few ways you could made it look like an egg, but it's literally a boat. I don't know. I guess it's pretty cool. I guess it's pretty cool, especially when you have the invisible head. But if you don't have it, then your head is just going to be literally in the middle of the boat. It's actually cool that whatever floats your boat and build a boat both get an egg. That's pretty cool. Uh, egg of the high skies. Yes. A robot ink egg. So this is something that not a lot of you guys know, but on my secret account, I was actually playing this game a lot. Like, a lot. Every time I was making a video, and some videos take like hours to make, I on my other screen, sometimes I just put on this game on my other account. So on my other account, I'm like super high level in this game. I have like faster speed. I have the strongest weapons and stuff. So yeah, I hope this is going to be a lot of fun to get. I'm super pro and kind of addicted to this game. So I hope I can also get it on my real account, Build a Source. Um, yeah, I really love the way this looks because it looks a lot like the robots from the game. So it just reminds me a lot of the games. If you don't like uh, Robot Inc. the game, then you probably don't like the egg. But because I've played it so much, it really reminds me of the game. So I love this egg. I love it. Very cool. Let's see. Egg Chanted. This egg can be obtained in Royale High. Oh, that is cool. Okay, so it's a red egg with like green spots on it. Oh, it has actually like a green leaf. Like it's a, it's like a strawberry actually. It's kind of like a straw. Look at it. it. Look, it has like the green on top and then the leaf. So it's kind of like a strawberry. That is cool. That is actually really cool. Uh, then it has a little crown and an arrow going through it. So very cool for people who like Royale High. Uh, I don't actually play that, but I hope we can get the egg still because we want to get them all. Got to catch them all, just like Pikachu. Got to catch all the eggs. Oh, Ventureland egg. I thought Ventureland was abandoned as a game. I don't know if you guys remembered. I once made a video about Ventureland when it first came out. I thought it was going to be super popular. Uh, it's a game where you can uh, drive your car, which is also a plane and also a boat at the same time. And you can make your own house and stuff. It's actually a really cool game. But I thought the makers quit making that game. But apparently not because they made well... I won't call it an egg <laughs> because it, it's barely like this. I guess this is kind of an egg shape. But yeah, it's just a lot plain, I guess. I guess your head is going to stick out, though. So I don't know about that. And here we have Ultimate Driving Westover Island. Okay, so that's that one car game uh, that is very popular. Where you can just drive your car over the highways and stuff. I remember that one. Every time I play that game, and I'm definitely going to do it again this, this time... I just get the lawnmower car, which is literally just a lawnmower and drive it on the highway. I love that. It's funny to me, okay? It's funny to me. I like how one person got it and disliked it. I don't like it. Don't like the egg. 
Okay, so it's... I don't know what it's supposed to be. White and black squares. I guess maybe like a finish line for a race. So my guess would be that you maybe have to win some kind of race in this car game. Because it looks a little bit like a finish line, the white and the black. And then there's like leaves around it like a medal. Like a medal or a prize kind of uh, decoration on it. So I'm guessing you have to win a race for it. But like to wear this on your head, I don't know. It's not that beautiful, I think. Okay, then we have a fried chicken egg. It doesn't even look like an egg. It's just a fr it's literally just a chicken leg with a chomp out of it. Just a bite out of it. I bet a lot of you guys will wear this because you like to eat chicken. Uh, you can get it in Zombie Rush. Wait, wait, chicken still exists when the zombies take over? Okay, uh, I don't really know what to say about this. It, it's one of those things where I think it's not really an egg. I mean, it's kind of an egg shape here, sure, but it's, it's literally a chicken leg. So, yeah, I don't know. Uh, then we have the Detective W. Wolf. Uh, which you can get from a game, A Wolf or Other, which is a stupid game name. I'm going to keep saying it. It's a stupid game name. Anyway, yeah, that werewolf game. I don't remember. I think we didn't like that one, but maybe it's fun this time. Maybe they've made updates. I don't actually remember at all how this game goes. I just remember it being not that much fun. But yeah, this egg looks pretty cool to wear it. If you, go if you make a suit that is this color, the same as the hat, so like the gray with the white, if you make a suit for that, then it's going to make a cool outfit. You can just be a werewolf in Roblox forever. Then we have Egobot 2020. So that is pretty cool. It's a helicopter with a noob in it. Very cool. The egg can be found in Plane Crazy. I don't remember that game. Is that the one with the... No, that's Itty Bitty Airport. Okay, I don't remember which one this is. But yeah, a helicopter egg. If you put this on your head, then it looks like a noob is controlling you. That's pretty funny. That's pretty funny, I think. Then we have the explosive artifact of energy. This egg can be obtained in Roblox Death Run. Yes. Yes. Another one of my favorite games in Roblox. Death Run is just a really good game. Uh, everyone should definitely try it at least once. And this is the perfect opportunity because she can get an egg. It's very cool uh, egg. I guess it's supposed to be like dirt with gems in it or ground with gems and little veins of gold and stuff. So it's like kind of like also a geology inspired egg. Okay. Obviously, I already guessed it uh, on Twitter like yesterday. Obviously, this one is the shark bite egg. I'm kind of disappointed because this is a shark model that is very ugly, but they keep using it in several... It's like a free shark. Like, let's say if I go to Roblox right now and I look for shark models. So this is like a super ugly... Look at, look at the weird nose. It has like... It has like a, almost like a, a, a trunk. Like an elephant's tr trunk. And they keep using this weird shark model everywhere in Roblox. Uh, Epic Minigames has it in that minigame where you get almost eaten by the shark. Um, and now apparently even in the shark bite egg, they use that same shark. Look at it. I'm sorry. I just... I don't know. I just don't really like the weird, the point, the weird pointy nose. Stop that. Sharks don't have a trunk, okay? Sharks don't have like a pointy and like that round mouth. Wait, is your head going to be in there? Because then you get bonus points. Okay, so here they have some from before. So this is the plain one from... Wait, oh, this one is broken. I don't think the wheels will be that big. That's probably a glitch. The wheels will be just normal size. Uh, and then here we have the shark. So your head is going to be in the mouth of the shark. Okay, you know what? I'll take it back. That is pretty cool that your head is going to be in... Your head is going to be in the mouth of the shark. That is really cool. I love that. I love that. Never mind everything, everything bad I said. That is pretty cool. Okay, you know what? I changed my mind. It's a pretty good egg. Your head is going to be in the mouth. That is cool. That is really cool. So here's the invasion egg. I thought it was jailbreak. Someone already corrected me on Twitter. I'm sorry. It's actually Mad City. It's kind of the same game, similar game. Uh, so it's like a purple egg. The city has been taken over by aliens, just like in Jailbreak. Uh, but I guess Mad City is kind of like Jailbreak number two. Okay, so that's pretty cool. You can have like a literal city on top of your head if you wear this egg. Okay, so then here we have the Fabergé egg or the Fabergé egg of the new decade. Oh, that's a pretty cool name. So it's actually because it's 2020, it's a new, de uh, new decade. And you have to get 
every single other egg to get this one. You have to get every other egg, otherwise you cannot have this one. So if you see someone with this egg, that means they have found every other egg, except for the YouTuber egg, the, develop, the, the pff, developer egg, and the... Wait, the Eggman, Influencer egg, and Developer egg. So those are three eggs that can be given by game makers, YouTubers, and Roblox staff. Which they will give with launchers, which we also have right here. Wait, let's actually look first. So this one looks pretty cool. Uh, I think it looks similar to one from a previous year, though. Not, an, not a Fabergé egg, but a different egg that they had. Um, but usually the Fabergé eggs are a lot smaller and they go on top of your head instead of, like, around your head. So maybe that's the case again this year. Okay, so here we have the launchers. You cannot really see them well. My guess is that the colorful one is the influencer launcher. This one is probably developer launcher. And this one is the Roblox admin egg giver. The admin giver. That's my guess. I'm not 100% sure. But I think that's it. And then here we have those eggs. So here we have the admin. So your face is going to be in it. That's pretty funny, I guess. So you have to find a Roblox admin uh, to find this one. Then here we have the developer egg. That is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Uh, of course, I don't count. Sadly, you have to be like the maker of a super big game to count. Um, if I ever get any launchers, of course, I will give all of you guys eggs. And then here we have the influencer egg. I don't actually love this one. I think the last year, or was it the year before? That one was a lot better looking, I think. Uh, it's very colorful. This looks like a typical Easter egg, painted egg. Um, it's only for people who are real YouTubers. Roblox thinks I'm not a real YouTuber. So I don't think this year I'm allowed to give those eggs. Maybe next year Roblox will finally accept me as a YouTuber. But I think this year I cannot give these eggs. But maybe we can find someone who can give the eggs. Like Jesse or Zenak or someone else. Or maybe Roblox will watch my videos and say, Hey Tommy, you can have an egg launcher this year. Finally. Anyway, that is the last one of the eggs. Oh my god, it took so long to record. I've, I think I've spent more than a minute on average per egg. Oh my god, this video is going to be so long. No, I was only supposed to make a short video. Okay, anyway, if you are excited for the egg one, please leave a like and subscribe. Subscribe. We're going to live stream as much as we can. If I ever get a launcher or find someone with a launcher, I'm going to try to get you guys some eggs as well. Um, and it's just going to be super fun. And maybe I'll get some real life stuff again. I'm not sure if I can. Last year, if I don't know if you guys remember, I got a lot of eggs in real life, like surprise eggs with toys in them. But not a lot of people like that, so I guess this year we'll try something else. Maybe I'll just get a few of them. But yeah, I really have to end this video here. Thank you for watching. Um, follow me on Twitter if you have Twitter. I tweet a lot lately because I found a way to schedule the tweets for later. So every time I think of like tweets, I will schedule them for later. Um, so follow me on Twitter for cool dinosaur posts. Uh, sometimes puppies and kittens and i'm trying to keep track i'm trying to jump rope every day of april and i'm keeping track on twitter for that so try to follow me on twitter if you have twitter it's also a way to send fan art and make sure to subscribe and hit the bell below the video because then you will get a little message every time i'm going to make like an egg hunt video or a different one and you will never miss anything and also as always big thank you to everyone who supports my channel by donating their names are on the screen right now thank you guys so much that is the end of this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to stomp like a dinosaur